Space holds so many mysteries still to this day, but astronomers are making new discoveries every day. From the theories of planet formation to the sighting of unique, one-of-a-kind celestial bodies, each one of these space discoveries gives us the key to understanding our universe. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be taking a look at three of these space discoveries. NASA Can't Explain Strange Spiral in Space In 2006, scientists finally uncovered the true nature of star AFGL 3068, a first-of-its-kind spiral object 3,000 light-years away in the constellation Pegasus. Before this discovery, scientists knew the star existed, but the object was too faint for scientists to determine exactly what the spot was. Only after a 33-minute long exposure with the ultra-sensitive advanced camera for surveys on the Hubble Space Telescope did scientists begin to really see the spirals come into view. Scientists found that the entity consisted of large, perfectly placed coils of dust floating out in the universe. Before AFGL 3068, the only spirals found in space were known as spiral galaxies. This star is nothing like a spiral galaxy. First of all, it is not a galaxy at all. Instead, it is made up of a binary star system that includes two stars orbiting around each other. The first star is a red giant carbon star, and the second is a blue-white star that exists 103 astronomical units away from the red giant. 103 astronomical units are approximately two times the distance between the Sun and Pluto. Since the two stars are so far from one another, they take approximately 800 years to orbit around each other. So, how are the spirals created? In the most basic sense, the red giant releases carbon material. This material then combines to form larger molecules, which create fine black dust. This dust covers the red giant and blocks all or most of its light. The blue-white star's gravitational pull tugs the dust toward itself and away from the red giant, but most of the dust ends up escaping into space during the process. As the two binary stars circle each other, the black dust escapes outward to form a spiral. After determining how the spirals were created, scientists wondered how the system was being illuminated. The dust being dispelled is dark and has no illumination qualities of its own, yet it could still be seen. The star could not have illuminated the spirals because it was also covered in the black dust, so scientists determined that the spirals were being illuminated by our own galaxy, the Milky Way. Interestingly, this is the only celestial body that is not illuminated by sunlight, starlight or fluorescence that has been photographed. While these phenomena might occur similarly in other systems, they were not officially discovered before AFGL 3068. This is because these phenomena can be difficult to find. First, the red giant is consistently losing significant amounts of mass in the form of black dust. That level of mass loss can only be temporary, and scientists must be in the right place at the right time. Second, the giant would have to be part of a binary system orbiting around another star big enough to have a large enough gravitational pull to draw in the black dust. This fantastic new discovery could help scientists and astronomers solve the many mysteries in other systems that were unsolvable before the discovery on AFGL 3068. Astronomers describe rare Black Widow star system. A new study describes a unique astronomical object called the Black Widow Pulsar. The star system named J0610-2100 is about 10,000 light-years from Earth. It was discovered in 2003 after scientists noticed periodic pulsing in the area. Scientists decided the system was a pulsar. A pulsar is a collapsed, highly magnetized star that rotates very quickly. They shoot out electromagnetic blasts out of their poles. So, if their pole is facing the Earth, we can see the light in space, but it quickly goes away as the star spins. For example, J0610-2100 flickers every 3.8 milliseconds as it turns around. The object was named after the Black Widow spider that famously eats other spiders of a smaller size. The Black Widow pulsar is made up of two stars, one larger and one smaller. The larger of the two is slowly devouring the smaller star by pulling most of the surrounding matter into space. 
In addition to removing any matter from its vicinity, the larger star hits the smaller star with consistent energy discharges. On J0610200, these pulses have been happening over the last hundred or even thousands of years. These hits of energy push much of the remaining star matter into space. Since the star could devour its smaller counterpart at some point, scientists want to study this system before it goes away. Emma van der Wateren, a doctorate student at the Netherlands Institute for Radio Astronomy, studied the Black Widow pulsar for years and analyzed 16 years of data from a radio telescope to discover more about the pulsar. She and her team found some unique and interesting things about this specific star system. First, this system has never shown any changes in timing. It was consistent and steady throughout the past 16 years. Typically, Black Widow pulsars are irregular and temperamental, which is why this finding is so important to astronomers. Second, the star system does not have a radio eclipse, which is found in most other Black Widow pulsars. A radio eclipse happens when radio emissions stop during a specific part of the star's orbit path around each other. Van der Wateren explains, This occurs when the companion star moves close to the front of the pulsar, and all this irradiated material coming off of the companion eclipses the pulse emission from the pulsar. While the radio eclipse is still stumping scientists, the steady timing has a clear and helpful purpose. Van der Wateren says, To detect gravitational waves, you need many, many very stable pulsars. And unlike earlier Black Widow pulsars that have been discovered, this system is very stable. Scientists believe that if they analyze the consistent energy pulses of the larger star, they might be able to detect gravitational waves, which are uncommon ripples in the fabric of space-time. Gravitational waves, theorized by Albert Einstein, appear when massive universal objects collide. The waves from the collision move through space and time at light speed and warp the fabric of the universe as they ripple past. Hubble finds a planet forming in an unconventional way The Hubble telescope has recently photographed the creation of a Jupiter-like planet named AB Aurigae b. NASA described the creation process as intense and violent. The planet is surrounded by a disk of dust and gas, forming a spiral structure around a young star theorized to be around 2 million years old. There have been two accepted theories for how planets are formed. The first is called core accretion, which suggests that planets within large disks collide and stick together over time as they complete their orbit around a star. Then this core is made up of fragments, takes gas from the disk to form a Jovian planet. Whereas the second theory, the one used to describe the formation of AB Eurigae b, is called the disk instability theory. This occurs when a large disk collides and fragments into clumps with their own gravitational force, creating planets. This new discovery cements the disk instability theory, showing how this Jupiter-like planet is being formed. The Hubble telescope has been taking images of AB Aurigae b for the past 13 years. Thane Curry, the lead researcher of the study, said, Interpreting this system is extremely challenging. At first, researchers were unsure if AB Aurigae b was even a planet, but after 13 years, their minds were changed. They have found that this planet is about nine times the size of Jupiter. Now, with evidence of how AB Aurigae b was created, researchers can better understand the beginnings of our solar system. Each one of these discoveries unlocks a new mystery to be solved and brings us one step closer to understanding the world beyond our planet. But what do you make of these space discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community by working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.